quick and simple way to make baby back ribs in the Instapot coming up. So folks, I have for you a quick and easy way to make ribs in the Instapot. You can use any type of seasoning you choose. I prefer to use Weber dry smoke rub and I'm going to also use some garlic powder. And I have one onion sliced in half. So what you want to do is you want to take your dry rub and put it on your ribs like that. Just coat them real nice. Get it in there. So before I put these ribs on this baking sheet, I went ahead and took off the back membrane because I want my ribs to fall off the bone. So you just season it up like that real nice. So before you put your ribs into your Instapot, you want to make sure you have a trivet, this little basket like this, and it just sits at the bottom of the Instapot to keep whatever you're putting in the Instapot from touching the bottom. You want to put a cup of water inside of your Instapot before you place the ribs onto that trivet. So I have pre-measured out one cup of water that I'm going to put in. Then I'm going to take my rib and I'm going to roll it with the meat side in. This is the way I do it. And I'm going to set it right on top of that basket. Take one half of the onion, set it in there. Take the other half, put it on this side here. Let's get those off. Then I'm gonna seal up my Instapot. After I have placed my lid on the Instapot, I ensure that the vents are closed. You press manual. You want to increase your time to 25 minutes. Make sure your pressure is on high. Now we're ready to remove our ribs from the Instapot and place them on this baking sheet. So first we need to release the pressure, but be careful, the steam is awfully hot. While this one is releasing steam, go ahead and heat your oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. While that's preheating, let's go ahead and take them out. After you have removed your ribs from the Instapot, use any barbecue sauce of your choice and just brush them with sauce. Once you've done brushing the sauce onto your ribs, you want to put them in your oven for about 10 to 15 minutes. After 10 minutes in the oven, you have a beautiful rack of ribs. Remember to like and share. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. We'll see you next time.